still unravished bride of quietness, thou foster child of silence and slow time. Sylvan historian who canst thus express a flowery tale more sweetly than our rhyme. While the French legend haunts about thy shape of deities or mortals or of both, in Temi or the dells of Arcady, what men or gods are these? What maidens loathe? What mad pursuit, what struggle to escape, what pipes and timbrels, what wild ecstasy. are sweet, but those unheard are sweeter, therefore ye soft pipes play on. Not to the sensual ear, but more endeared, pipe to the spirit, it is of no tone. Fair youth beneath the trees thou canst not leave, thy song nor ever can those trees be bare. For the lover never, never canst thou kiss Though in near the boy, yet do not grieve She cannot fade, though thou hast not thy bliss Forever wilt thy love, and she Boughs that cannot shed your leaves, nor ever be the spring of you. And happy melodist, unwearied, forever piping songs, forever new. More happy love, more happy, happy love, forever warm and still to be enjoyed, forever patty. A breathing humor, a passion far above That leaves a heart, thy sorrowful and cloyed A burning for her, and a parching tongue A parching tongue Coming to the sacrifice 
to what green altar, O mysterious priest? Leadest thou that heifer lowing up the skies, and all her silken flames with garlands dressed? What little town by river or seashore, or mountain built with peaceful citadel? Emptied of his folk, his pious one, on little town my streets forevermore, for silent be, and not a soul to tell, while thou art desolate. with greed of marble men and maidens overwrought with forest branches and the trodden weed the silent formness tease us out of thought as doth eternity called pastoral when all as shall this generation waste thou shalt remain in midst of other than ours that friend a man to whom thou sayest Beauty is truth, truth beauty That is all ye know on earth And all ye need to know And all ye need to know oh. Beauty is truth 